Hi there guys, it's Pip here from pipweekly.com and uh, today I just want to talk to you about something a little bit different and you'll have noticed that I'm holding this uh, cornflakes box from Tesco and you're probably thinking, well why on earth is she doing that? Well, today um, is just a day for a little bit of a factoid, something you might not know and I just want to let you know that things that are good do happen all year round in order to do that, I'd like to talk to you about a charity called Magic Breakfast. Now, I'd never heard of Magic Breakfast before until I bought these cornflakes box from Tesco. I love my cornflakes. Uh, cornflakes are, as well, quite cheap, so uh, that's an added bonus for me. Um, and I just want to read to you what they're about, and I'll read it off the side of the box. So, Magic Breakfast is for uh, children, uh, breakfast clubs, that sort of thing. Um, and they're a UK registered charity and the, the simple goal is to make sure that no child goes to school hungry and starts their education every day hungry because children do not learn well. Uh, they support hundreds of breakfast clubs across the UK and in the most disadvantaged communities and they provide um, thousands of breakfasts for kids every single day. Um, and they work with Tesco, so Tesco has an ambition to, um, you know, sort of contribute towards this, make sure that everyone lives um, healthily and has a, you know, happy start to the day. And, um, you know, they, they, they believe that education shouldn't um, be made kind of less effective because somebody is sitting there and they're not thinking about maths or English or concentrating on the work. They're thinking about what they're going to eat and where they're going to get the next meal from. Um, now, I know at school uh, there were children in my class who were on kind of meal credits, that sort of thing, and I didn't really understand it as a child because I'd never been through that myself. I was quite lucky. Um, I've never had a day when um, I haven't had a meal on the table. Um, you know, we weren't fed fancy things of children but we certainly never went hungry and um, I can't imagine what it must be like to be a child or to be a parent and worry about where you're going to get food from um, you know there's always been cases in the news I remember reading about one very sad case several years ago where the child in fact died um, and, and this was a terrible story in which the child it was reported that this child used to grab things out of other children's lunch boxes because it was so hungry. Um, and you can imagine what kind of effect that had on, on friendships and relationships um, and the kind of life that child must have lived. Um, so it's not just about feeding the child, it also has a wider impact on their life as well. Um, you know, they're not feeling like they can't go out and play football because they feel weak or because their peers don't like them because they're always grabbing food or asking for food um, you know just things like that so I just wanted to highlight that to you today again it's called Magic Breakfast and it's just there to let you know that great things happen in this world um, so that is pretty much all from me today a bit of good news and until next time you take care bye now